ProTest Series 2 is an ideal instrument for checking and calibrating both click type and dial type torque wrenches. To set the instrument up, simultaneously press the two left hand side buttons on the display. The software version will be displayed, followed by the language selection menu. The protest is programmed with test parameters defined by the ISO Torque Wrench Standard 6789-2003. When selected this will automatically calculate the permissible tolerance in accordance with ISO 6789 at 20%, 60% and 100% of the target torque. Selection of the non-ISO mode enables the operator to set their preferred tolerance band in terms of percentage of target value. The protest can operate in a wide range of units, both metric and imperial. Units of measurement can be selected or deselected accordingly using the tick or cross button. Protest has an integrated serial port. The parameters of the port can be configured by a simple menu. And then the thresholds can be set up, including auto reset hold time between 1 and 4 seconds, and first peak sensitivity, high, medium or low. There are two operating modes available, dial and electronic and click and cam. Either one or both can be selected using the cross and tick buttons. To operate the protest, first select the units of measurement and the mode of operation, in this case click and cam. If using the ISO standard feature, set the target torque value using the plus and minus buttons on the right hand side of the display. If your target torque is set to 100% of the torque wrench capacity, the percentage button will automatically display the torque value for the 60% and 20% calibration increments as required by the standard. Apply the torque. The green light will indicate that the torque is within the limit defined by the ISO standard. Nullbar offers software for generating calibration certificates in accordance with ISO 6789-2003. It is available free of charge from the Nullbar website www.nullbar.com. For dial type or electronic torque wrenches, select the dial in the electronic mode. Operate the wrench until the desired torque is achieved. Then simply compare the dial or display with the reading held on the protest display.